Well, I, I think it is important to note that he made uh, a decision not to use those other roads. And uh, that's, that's a decision I have to look at as a reflection on how he felt about the rest of the school that he was a part of. Uh, he had many people that were his friends and uh, his acquaintances, and uh, we're concerned about them and we're working with them today. But as we talk with him, we also realize that uh, he really did care about them. And you know, the, we'll what we're looking at now to try to uh, either uh, help yeah. other kids yeah. that may be uh, directly no, involved with uh, relationships okay. with them, uh, or for uh, other situations right. that we would try to certainly prevent. Well, let me uh, the next few weeks are also critical, though, I think, first of all, to take care of our kids and to make sure that they're okay. Uh, the adults involved, too. Uh, this has been a, a traumatic incident for all folks in our community not just our children, uh, but certainly there are main focus. Uh, the, the, uh, the environment inside is one of uh, uh, great concern for each other, and uh, a lot of effort is being made by the entire community, not just the school community. Uh, we have pastors here, we have mental health uh, individuals that have come from the county. The kids just want to be with each other. They, they want to talk with each other, they want to have a chance to know that their friends are okay, and that uh, that they've started their grieving process together.